Hello, and welcome to Daily Podcast number nine. This is Eric Dobson, and today I just wanted to take a minute and talk a little bit about dental hygiene. I promise it's actually probably going to be exactly as boring as it sounds, but I hope not. Um, a few days ago, and now I will say too, this is going to be a post a little better for the uh, YouTube viewers. This is first and foremost a podcast, uh, so I will make every effort to uh, not rely on visuals, but uh, today I'm going to actually be showing one or two small things, so uh, the YouTube viewers will have a slight advantage here. Um, a few days ago, I showed a new thing I got in the mail. Uh, it's a dental floss dispenser. Now, this is one of my kind of extreme overboard purchases. Uh, it's called the Pure Floss Dispenser. I got mine from Practicon Dental, and uh, I think they think I'm a dentist now because who else would order from them? But they sent me, you know, the little flexible tubes that do the suction when you go to the dentist? They sent me a couple of sample suction tubes, so whatever. Um, so yeah, I have this die cast, uh, ultra heavy duty, going to last a lifetime floss dispenser now, but what I really wanted to go with it and, uh, just came yesterday is, uh, these floss handles. Now, if you haven't heard of these, they're, they're by the gum, uh, company corporation. I always see them advertised as Butler gum, but it might just be gum, G U M gumbrand.com. Um, it's the floss mate floss handle. Now for the people listening, as this is a podcast, uh, it's basically this Y shaped handle. It's got a flat handle, uh, two prongs come up that the floss is going to be kind of suspended between these to put some tension on it. And then there's a, a little button on it that you actually wrap the floss around. Uh, so yeah, I'll, I'll you know, make this as good as I can for the listeners. Um, but basically, that's it. I mean, you take your floss. I think you can use a little less than usual uh, since you're not going to need a whole lot to hold with your fingers. Just wrap it once around the button. goes up one side of the Y, across to the other, back down, wrap around the button to secure. And now you've got this floss on a handle. And the really cool thing about this is not, you know, you can buy these little disposable uh, floss handles and to me, those are pretty worthless. They don't really do a whole lot for me. And the problem is they are kind of vertically oriented that when you put it in your mouth, the floss is going front to back. Well, that's fine for your front teeth, not so great for the molars. And those are the hard ones to get at anyways. The really cool thing about this is the angle it puts it at. When you put it in your mouth, it's actually going side to side. So it's easy enough to turn it sideways and get your front teeth the really cool thing is how easy it is to reach in the back, get the molars. Um, it's awesome. So yes, I do get excited about flossing. What can I say? Uh, so that's kind of the cool thing today. Um, and actually, okay, I will in all uh, full disclosure, the one negative to this, and uh, again, the people on YouTube watching can see this, there's really only about an inch of space, uh, an inch of floss that's that's showing. And that's fine, that's enough to do the job, um, but your floss does wear out a little more. And the one negative to this is it's not as simple to just grab a little further down the floss. Uh, so you kind of have to reset the whole thing an inch over if you want to um, keep some fresh floss regularly throughout your, your flossing. So yeah, that's the one negative. Um, it's not as bad as I'm making it look here because I'm doing it left-handed. Uh, but overall, I think the uh, benefits far outweigh that tiny negative. So yeah, if you neglect your flossing as pretty much we all do, uh, it's really awesome. I think this thing honestly makes me much more li likely to floss, uh, much more effective, enjoyable, easier. So yeah, you're not trying to stuff all your fingers in your mouth to get those back teeth. So that's the gum floss mate floss handle and uh yeah check it out it's uh i think what do they go for like two or three bucks which seems like a lot for a little piece of plastic but um they pretty much last forever so there it is that's the excitement today do your flossing you won't regret it and uh this floss mate handle makes it a lot easier and uh there it is so tomorrow who knows uh, i'm actually thinking of a few new features i may start uh, but we will see how it goes. Thanks again for listening. 
Thanks for watching on YouTube, and uh, you can find more at ericdobson.com. These daily podcasts are just the start of a lot of things to go. I've had the site up for about a year, coming up on a year, and I really only posted a couple dozen posts, but this is really the start of a, a whole new phase. So if floss handles or other completely random things are interesting to you, stay tuned. There is really a lot more to come. So take care, speak soon, and uh, thanks for listening.